Hello everyone, Sergeant274. Today we are taking a look at Priscilla's Dagger. Uh, Priscilla is in the Painted World and we'll take a little bit of a look later on how to acquire this dagger. Anyways, um, let's take a look at the stats here real quick. It has an S scaling uh, for dex, dex only. You can see their bleed buildup is 500. And then uh, it also has 110 dark damage. It's not added into the uh, 269 total uh, physical damage. Anyway, um, it, this takes dragon scales to upgrade, and dragon scales are kind of hard to come by, and uh, cost 10,000 per upgrade level, so this is a plus 5, so whatever. There is the R2 one-handed, so it's kind of like the Painted Guardian Sword, with, where you can combo it like that. You can combo it with an R1 or an R2, which is what this is, R2 with the R2. And there's a few R1s in there, so you can keep going for uh, quite some time with that if you stun lock someone or if they don't have good armor or no poise. Yeah, you can you can do some damage with this, especially with the bleed buildup associated with this. We're talking about in PvP. It also would work for PvE um, against enemies susceptible to bleed. So there's a two-handed combo with the R2. So. It's pretty nice, pretty nice weapon. You could, uh, you know, two hand it or uh, have a dagger in each hand and do some damage, kind of like uh, uh, the Painted Guardians or uh, Ciaran does. So the rest of the attacks pretty standard. Um, the big thing with this is, like I said, the combos, like the Painted Guardian sword has, and uh, the bleed buildup. This weapon is not. Um, you cannot buff it. Uh, I'll show you that a little later on. When I try to put Dark Moon Blade on here, and it shouldn't work. Alright, anyways, um, let's take a look in on Orlando at how this thing will do. Alright, here we are. There's the stats there 40 endurance, 40 dex, and a plus 5 Priscilla's dagger. So let's see what it does against these giants in giant armor. 88. So you can see how fast it is. And just think if that's a. Uh, against the person or player susceptible to bleed that will that will bleed them out in no time this fool is going to try to heal on me here and he does not get around to uh, completing that alright so let's see how it does against the silver knight up here I want to R2 it two handed uh, I did some damage there but he flattened me on my back. So now let's just backstab and make sure we don't die from the giant that wants to come up here. So that's still good damage. A backstab 505 I think it was. It's still gonna, it's gonna kill him in one shot. Here I missed um, a plunging attack and he decided to squish me. That was nice. Alright, let's see. What can we do here? Let's go between his legs. That attack. Alright. R2s or excuse me, two-handed R1s. Forgive me. Let's see if we can get a combo in here. Yeah, he jumped out of the way. Because apparently he's wearing his Nike Air Jordans today. I missed there. See, the range, you have to be so close with daggers, but um, they're fast and all that spinning and twirling action is its pretty cool. Alright. Against Mr. Silver Knight down here. Again, this should be 505, right? Yes, sir. And this guy, let's see, what can we do to him? There's an R2 one-handed, so decent damage. Obviously, this guy has good armor on, and he has a good shield, and he's not, he has poise, so it's not going not gonna to get too many combo hits on him. But you can spam a... Uh, your light attacks there. So, not bad. Let's see what a parry does here. 626. So, yeah, a regular backstab and a parry obviously will uh, one shot him. There's a jumping attack, 237. So, that's half. It's about half their health there, isn't it? There is some more. Um, or less. More or less. I don't know. Two jumping attacks did it with a miss in between. Or partial. Alright. Hornet ring time. Let's see what this bad boy will do with the hornet ring. 
Again, remember, there is 110 dark damage not factored into the stats. Um, or the physical damage stats that the weapon shows. Anyways, kind of like Velka's Rapier. That, I believe, has dark damage as well. So, yeah. Alright, here, let's try to put Darkling Blade on it. See, you can't put a, a buff on. Oh, Pris's Dagger. So, let's see what we can do with this guy. I was going to try to roll in and out. <laughs> Stupid spears. I hate the spear guys. Not too bad. Two-handed attack. Does pretty good damage. So, alright. How do you get this weapon? Well, oh, where's my girl? Where's my girl? Oh, I'm so sorry, girl. I hate to do this to you. This is how you get Priscilla's dagger. There's her tail. Instead of tapping her tail, you gotta cut it off. I'm sorry. So there you go, and you get her dagger. And then she disappears, and she tries to kill you, and you better have good um, armor on that protects against bleed because her life hunt scythe. Yeah, you see how much bleed damage that inflicted. So. Alright, well, thank you for watching, everyone. Um, I appreciate it. Um, I think I beat her. <laughs> I think I win here. She's not that powerful. I think you can make her reappear with, like, Pyromancy or something. I don't know. Anyways, yeah. If you, if you don't get her dagger, keep trying. Alright, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.